and welcome back to the Dark Cosmic Universe. My name is Avian Savage. I had to just catch my breath there. Uh, this is the Dark Cosmic Universe. Oh my gosh. I cannot tell you how ecstatic I am finding this figure. If you have been a follower of this channel and you know a little bit about my very unique um, collections of figures, um, a, few, a little while ago, uh, I don't know, maybe sometime last year, and I can't remember, um, I wound up finding the Hollywood NWO Hulk Hogan, Hollywood Hogan. I found um, Scott Hall, better known as the bad guy, a.k.a. formerly Reza Ramon. And then I had to find Kevin Nash. Big sexy diesel whatever you want to call him found him i could not believe it so ecstatic went to my local walmart and they had this it wasn't an end cap it was a cap right before like a middle cap inside the aisle right before the toys and they had all these wrestling figures and who did my eyes see big sexy himself i'm like i need him so bad oh my gosh I was actually going to even contemplate finding them on, on eBay and, you know, just buying them. But again, finding things on eBay, I understand the whole online process. I get it. You find it, it's listed, it's secure, it's in your home. But there's something about finding a figure when you're out of the stores in the wild and then seeing the figure that you need the most, you know, um, right there. So again, the WWE Superstar Collection, um, this is a Walmart exclusive only. And when um, Kevin Nash and Scott Hall came out, um, Scott Hall had actually, I believe, passed away uh, a few months later before the, uh, or after the figure had been released. And it was in high demand. And of course you can see why, because it's the NWO. And I'll probably get criticized from here till whenever but nwo was one of the best if not um uh you know the number one wrestling gimmick of all time you know i mean there are others that have happened but this was the one that changed wrestling at least for myself when hulk hogan scott hall kevin nash were in wcw and kevin nash and scott hall they were the outsiders, uh, you know, the bad guys from another wrestling organization invading WCW. And you're like, oh my gosh, what are they doing here? And then all the havoc that they caused, they wound up making such a splash. Anyway, so here is the figure. We're going to get right to it. Again, thank you so much for following my channel if you have. If this is the first time, hey, I would appreciate if you would like this video you don't have to but i appreciate it um subscribe it's completely free and get notified when i have these great really well again i call them my great um wrestling finds or toy finds or whatever you want uh, i'm also on facebook check out the um check out my description page or my description where it'll give you to the dark cosmic universe on facebook uh, i am on instagram avian underscore s-a-v-a-g-e one and also i have an ebay page but you know what let's get to the figure here because enough of me gabbing away okay the card art is amazing now i did actually meet kevin nash uh, with my nephew and a friend and uh, hopefully i'll be able to talk about that and again, it was the first time meeting a, a, a WWF. I'm going to say WWF because I'm old school, baby, and I can say that. And a WCW star locally. And, you know, actually meeting him and getting his picture and making a, auto, you know, making a, a sign. Yes. AV, you're, you're truly, Avian actually made a sign for Kevin Nash because he was in, uh, he was having a rival, rivalry. Is that right? A rivalry? That's it with uh the late mike awesome and when i came up to kevin nash and i mean i'm finally meeting the guy 
And he had this glazed look on his eyes. And hey, you know what? He's a superstar, so he can do what he wants. Um, I finally got, you know, up to meeting him. I showed him the sign and it said, uh, you know, Kevin Nash, kick Mike Awesome, you know, or, or something against Mike Awesome, punch Mike Awesome for me, or something like that. I can't remember. I made this huge sign, you know, Wolfpack, maybe Kevin Nash. And he looked at it like, uh, okay, what is this? And I'm like, dude, when you see Mike Awesome, I'm like, hit him once for me. And he looked at me and he saw the sign. And, he, and this is what he said to me, eh? And, well, let's say this way, Kevin Nash, up close and personal, wasn't the most friendly person, but again, you know, it's what it was. You know, I got to meet him, got his autograph. Disappointing, you know, unfortunately. But, you know, those are, that was him in his highlight days where, you know, they could wind up going to all these meet and greets and they can be in whatever condition that they want. So let's open up the figure here. Uh, again, uh, I definitely want to say thank you everyone for following the channel. I'd like to say hello to all my new subscribers who uh, who've been tagging along, and where I think it's somewhere 116 um, people who are following the channel. So thank you so much. We've gone from one follower or two followers, whatever it was, to 116. So I'm pretty happy about that. And uh, you know, again, I say I think thank you to everyone. So let's take a look at the card art really quick. Here he is, Kevin Nash, good old Diesel or whatever. Now, I had the Toy Biz version of this, gave it away, you know, um, and that was pretty stupid. Anyway, so here we go. So here we go. Kevin Nash, Wolfpack Rules. That's right. He's got the red and the black attack. Too sweet. You know you got to say that. So NWO, and here it is. So this is where the big boys play. That is a reference, so in case anyone ever wants to know, in regards to WCW when they were um, on Turner, as a TV, a Turner Broadcast. So when Turner owned WCW, that's where the big boys would play, so all the big superstars. So in this line, we've got Scott Hall, which I do have. Kevin Nash just acquired him. Uh, Ultimate Warrior, which I do have. And I do not have Shawn Michaels yet. Uh, if you need the barcode to know where it could be at um, Here are some of the things. So thank you so much Mattel for doing this We're gonna open them up because I've been waiting for such a long time To actually add this to my collection now in the back here. They have the alternative hands. Oh Are you kidding me? I don't know if you can see this but his fingers are doing are, are doing the uh the wolf pack uh the too sweet look with the fingers that is awesome oh my gosh I talk about attention to detail thank you so much mattel for doing this i appreciate it and again you know getting all these figures back uh one at a time you know i did have quite a collection uh got rid of it i was moving you know stupid me Could, shouldn't have done that and uh it was like a trading deal and the deal went really bad for me and i shouldn't have gotten rid of the figures because it would have probably been worth a mint today but yours truly is just kind of slowly getting back into wrestling uh, i haven't watched it like i said i get the classic stuff and some of the new stuff you know which i have seen um it's pretty good so anyway uh yeah so here we're going we're going to go to the figure now just to let you know that there are other people on youtube here who do give reviews for all these figures and they may say wow this was great or this is terrible and if I say something, this is my opinion. Again, you can take it, you can leave it, but again, this is my opinion, what, uh, you know, my opinion with these figures. And I am not the guru or the, you know, the all ending. Again, check other people's, uh, you know, channels out there. See what they think about these figures. They may have different opinions, but that's okay. Let's bust them out of here. I'm breaking out Kevin Nash for the second time in my life of having a Kevin Nash figure. Um, and I, again, I waited for this one because it's the same scale as the He-Man figures, and we'll go over that. Uh, again, if you are watching this channel for the first time, please, uh, you know, again, check out all the other videos that I have if you've just said, hey, who is this guy? And what's he about? Wait, he's got an Instagram? That's pretty awesome. Hold on a minute. Did I see an eBay page? He's selling some stuff? Of course. 
So got some uh, retro, got some vintage t-shirts. Go check those out. I do have some wrestling figures, but I mean wrestling, sorry, shirts. All right, uh, but you know, like I said, hope you check it out. And here we go. Here are the, the pleather pants that Kevin Nash has. I'm assuming they do come off. I'm not gonna try it. Um, we've got the NWO shirt here. He's got his WCW championship belt, which I'm probably gonna, uh, I'm still gonna get, uh, you know, other ones. Oh yeah, so it looks like under here we have his tank top that is painted on. So it's probably on the other side. But here it is, the belt. I'm like, gotta love it. All right, let's break them out, shall we? All right. So we've got the bad guy himself. Hey, yo. We've got Kevin Nash. And we've got Hollywood Hogan. Now, these characters are a little bit cartoony. So, you know, I mean, they weren't probably real scanned. Um, but you know what? That's okay to me because... They're going to look really good in my collection, and I'm pretty happy with them. And the cool thing is, they're just like... All right, so let's take a look real quick. Um, the scale, he is just around um, almost six inches. Pretty cool. And we're going to take a look at the figure. And if you collect the, the retro um, Masters of the Universe figures, you can see how they scale up, or scale up really close. And they're... Again, I believe that Mattel, when they made these, they had the similar bodies. And you can see where they were doing stuff like this. Anyway, so let's take a look really quick with some articulation. Um, so the arms do go up and down. I'm not sure if that's a ball joint or they just, I think they just go up and down. Um, the elbows have a joint in there. Um, the wrists, um, they do pop out so you can change the wrists. Uh, oh, and he's got some wrestling armbands. Um, gotta love that. And he's got his tattoo. Don't know if you can see it. Uh, again, the, uh, he's got the pleather, um, pants with the, uh, the frills on the side. He has got the Kevin Nash look down and he is definitely way too sexy. He is the sexy guy himself. Wow. This is pretty cool. So again, kudos out to Mattel. Kudos out to them, you know, reaching out to the classic fans. And, um, oh my gosh, I am so happy with these characters. And again, yeah, they're a little cartoony, but that's okay. Because you know what? It's fine with me. You know, you can get these guys in the wrestling ring. What you doing, brother? We've been hanging and banging at Gold's Gym for such a long time, brother. We were missing you, Big Kev. You know, Big Sexy. Hey, yo. Let's go hang out. You and me. Big Kev. That's my uh, that's my impression. I cannot do Kevin Nash. Anyway, thank you so much for checking this figure out. Uh, you're checking out this review out. I'm so happy with them. Thank you again. I'm waiting for the next superstars to start rolling out. If you have not gotten these figures, why not? What are you waiting for? I mean, again, all you know, you can switch their hands out. They've got some accessories. I will be buying some more belts um, because I want some more realistic ones. Um, for the for the characters, I mean, and I, you know, I didn't do, I didn't check out what his eyes look like. We're gonna check it out. So I'm gonna pop his glasses up, and hopefully the paint is good. Yeah, they did a good job. His eyes aren't like all wonky and everything. Does it look like Kevin Nash? A little bit, you know. Uh, kind of looks like the Big Lebowski, but that's okay. But it's Kevin Nash to me, and I'm all excited. Anyway, thank you so much for joining the Dark Cosmic Universe. Please, uh, again, let's, let's grow this channel. Um, every like, every share, every view helps um, YouTube send traffic my way so other people can see what we're into. Um, and don't forget, I'm on Facebook, um, Instagram, and then check out my eBay store. And again, those proceeds will buy more toys. And I do have some more videos coming up Trust me, some really fun stuff that I found. But let's do a do a quick, quick, quick uh, extreme close-up of Kevin Nash with Hulk Hogan, Scott Hall, the original triad of terror. It was NWO. You guys are awesome. You guys are. You will always be 
the best for me. You guys are for life. All right, everyone. Thanks again. Thanks. And I will see you sometime soon here on the YouTube sphere. Stay cool. Stay cosmic. And tune in the next time when we're loading up another video here on the YouTube sphere. Thanks again. See you soon. Bye.